I, it sometimes see if if it is based on everything that we receive that we are going to be reaching out, then I will be reaching out to people every day. This today I still receive message about Bob Risky. About a few days ago I still received message about Tunde Ednot. I'm telling you the truth. It's not a joke. Yes, you know, actually, to... I uh, I uh, you know in trying to research you yesterday, I, and I yes. think at the end of the day you asked a claim. Is it claim or Haneme to call you? Yes, I yes. Know, yeah, I don't know if it was in that program or was it about a month ago or thereabout. I saw a vision about Bob Risky. God said I should warn you that your doom is near. This is the time that your repentance will be acceptable. You are a man turning yourself into a woman. God is not happy about it. Let me tell you what I saw. I saw you laying down and I see some of the part of your body decaying. I saw you in pains. They started hiding you. They don't want people to know what is going on with you. I saw you being rejected in different hospitals. Please, this is a time for you to change your ways. And this is not for Bob Risky alone. Why most of us talk about Bob Risky is that Bob Risky is influencing so many people. The Bible says that anyone that makes these young ones to sin shall be doomed. The Bible says it is even better to put a stone on your neck and be thrown inside the river than to be allowed by devil to use you to destroy young people's life. I am begging you, this is the time for you to change, Bob Risky. Change your ways. God is still opening the note of your repentance. God is still giving you a chance. Repent now before it becomes late. And this that I'm talking about is coming very soon. You will not decay in Jesus' name. Your life will not be destroyed. It is not a big deal for you to turn a new leaf. Don't worry. People might laugh at you, they might start dragging you. It is better for you to have your peace and to repent than for you to regret in pains. Change your ways. Pobriski. God bless you.